Hi, I'm Dave Hansen, the Executive Director of Authors Alliance, which is a nonprofit that exists to support authors who uh, write for the public interest, who want their works to be widely read and disseminated um, and accessible uh, all around the world. I want to talk a little bit about why libraries and in particular online access to library collections is so important to authors. Uh, you know, authors write for a whole variety of reasons. Of course, authors need to be paid, uh, authors need to make a living, but at base, what authors really are writing for is for their readers. They want people, all sorts of people, people who can afford their books, people who need access through other means uh, to, to engage with their ideas and understand what they're saying. Um, and like I said, there's a whole variety of ways that authors go about achieving that kind of access, but libraries are an incredibly important one. One of the things that libraries do for authors, it, is, it expands access to uh, their materials. Um, it puts their books in the hands of readers who would never otherwise encounter their works. So one of the big issues that we face today, though, is that libraries uh, online are hampered from providing access to authors' books. Um, this happens in a variety of ways. Uh, the first is um, through restrictions on ebooks. Uh, so, the way that the current system works is that libraries have lots of uh, limitations on how they can provide ebooks to users. Some publishers won't even license ebooks to libraries. Uh, other publishers will say that libraries have to keep paying over and over and over again. And they exercise very tight control over the content and access to those works in ways that are really limiting uh, for libraries and their users. Um, the other way that libraries face a big challenge today is that they have no real way of, of providing uh, access to their physical collections um, by digitizing them and putting them online. Uh, the publishers uh, and the copyright system has been, have been thought to uh, really restrict libraries' ability to do that. Uh, there are some emerging tools. There's a, a concept um, and a, uh, a system called controlled digital lending, or uh, in the European Union, um, often referred to as a secured digital lending, uh, that allows libraries to scan um, and provide digital access to users online in the same way that they provide uh, print access. So those two things, those those two issues, are incredibly important. Uh, for authors because they want to see libraries um, grow. They want to see libraries uh, modernize and provide access in the online space in a way that um, the law and the publishing industry uh, has, has really tried to constrain over the last uh, decade or two. And so, um, so for me and from Authors Alliance, uh, these are two of the really, really important issues that we want to see Knowledge Rights 21 uh, and libraries all across Europe uh, really make progress on. Thank you.